I don't know if you could tell, the traffic light is one working there. Oh, I don't even know. No, you didn't know? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and I hate doing intros, so <laughs> it takes me a while sometimes to yeah. do it. So you have to bear with me, okay? okay? Let me see my hairs, okay? <laughs> okay. Hi guys, welcome back to Drive London. I'm Rohit and this is Hannah. And we're about to do a mock test for you guys. Um, okay, so Hannah's done about 32 yeah. hours. Yeah. yeah, 32 hours of um, learning to drive with us and she hasn't had any other lessons other than with us yep. and uh, we're about to do a first mock test mm -hmm. she has a test in a couple of days is it about three? Thursday yeah, yeah Thursday so in three days time and hopefully she'll be ready for it yeah yep. okay so today's mock test is going to be around the, the route that we've chosen is going to be around the test time that she's going to have and um, we're going to follow the whole route test route by following the sat nav mm -hmm. okay um, and do you know how the test works as well yeah yeah so I'm gonna tell you yeah, anyways you yeah so it's gonna last for 40 minutes during those 40 minutes yeah. we're just gonna keep following the road yeah. ahead there'll be 20 minutes of independent driving in your mm -hmm. real test but for today's lesson uh, for today's test we're gonna be following the sat nav the yeah. whole time yeah. and in your real test there'll be 20 minutes of them giving you directions okay. and you'll have one maneuver and mm -hmm. possibly the emergency stop and there'll be one tell me and one show me question yeah. okay okay, okay. Um, any questions no Good. So whenever she makes mistakes, as you're probably aware, but for those that don't know, um, any serious or dangerous mistakes will be at the top in red here. Any uh, minor mistakes will be in amber, and any um, good points will be up in green at the top here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Ready to start? Yeah. All right. So we'll start with the tell me question first. Could you tell me how you would check to see if your um, power steering is working correctly? Um, you turn on your car and you steer the wheel. If it feels light, then your power steering is working. Okay, thank you. Yep. Um, so I'm going to give you first direction. We're going to go mm -hmm. down to the end of this road and we're going to turn left and then I'd like you to follow the sat nav there okay. after. Okay. And that should be tired. Okay, so whenever you're ready, you may start.
100 yards, turn right. Turn right.
300 yards, go left on the roundabout, first exit. So I'd like you to wash and clean the front windscreen for me, please. Okay. That's great, thank you.
<coughs> Get a little bit close to the car. Okay. But leave yourself enough room to move away. That's great. So whenever you're ready, I'd like you to drive on again for me, please.
hundred yards, cross the roundabout, second exit, then take the third left. <coughs> cross the roundabout, second exit, then take the third left. This climb front to you to reverse parallel park for me, please. Okay, reverse yes, please. So, using that silver car, park within two car lengths of the car without touching. Is it here if I park in front of Yeah, that's right. Okay. So, within the two car spaces yeah. of that car, yeah, okay. yeah.
drive on again for me, please?
100 yards, go right on the roundabout, second exit. Go right on the roundabout, second exit. So we're just going to park up just yeah. before that green car on the left there, yeah. That's great. That's it, we'll keep, we can get quite close to this car. Quite close. Yeah, that's great. Turn left, mm -hmm. then you have reached your destination. Okay. Um, good, yep, if you just secure your car, turn off your engine for me. Just give me a moment, let me just quickly tell you this all up. Turn off the engine? Yes, please. Okay, how do you think you're done? I think, okay, but I think there was one serious mistake. Okay, what do you... What well, do you... I don't know if there was one, I th maybe there was more, but I know for sure I did one. On okay. the big roundabout. Okay. What happened on the big roundabout? I didn't signal off, and I think I wasn't like in the right lane, and like I just switched lane. Okay, yeah, you're yeah. correct. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Is that serious? Um, now, what part of that is a serious mistake, okay? Uh, so, yeah, unfortunately, you failed mm -hmm. the test and you got one serious mistake, mm -hmm. but you got 18 minors as well, okay? Now, I am a little bit strict yeah, yeah. on the minors, as you're probably aware, yeah. um, but we want to make sure these minors don't creep up yeah. as well, okay? So, the, some of them are yeah. advisories, but we'll talk about them later. Okay. But let's talk about one serious mistake. Yep. So, you're correct. We're on... Um, Hospital Bridge Roundabout, where we're turning right mm -hmm. third exit. And then you've got those hatch markings. We've gone over those really well. Yeah. Um, as you've gone, gone round, yeah. now the traffic lights are red there and the learner yeah. car in front is now 
he's positioning back yeah, to the yeah. left, and you was originally going to start positioning in the right lane yeah, at that point, yeah. correct? And then that, and I think you realised that you know what, I could actually be positioned yeah. in the left now. So you checked your mirrors, you yeah. kind of moved over. I mean, at this point, yes, mm -hmm. your lane discipline's a bit all over the mm -hmm. place because you're bit, you're going over to the right to begin with yeah. and having to switch over. Yeah, but yeah. you checked your mirrors, which is fine. Yeah. So I said, yeah. you know what, this is fine. She's checking her mirrors; okay. it's safe. She's moved back to her left. Yeah. And at this point, you forgot to do your left signal yeah, to take yeah. your exit. Yeah. So that's a minor itself. I always forget that left signal. Yes, correct. <laughs> um, now, but because you're already in the left-hand lane, that would be classed as just a minor. Okay. okay? Because your positioning, yeah, yeah. being in the left-hand lane, yeah, means yeah, that we're taking the next yeah, exit. Yeah. Um, had you been in the overtaking lane, the lane yeah, that you yeah. was originally yeah. going for and you had yeah. no signal, that could have been a serious yeah. mistake. Because that lane can go straight ahead at okay. that exit, or you can co um, go to the next exit on yeah. the right. Okay. okay. So that was that would have just been a minor but then the serious mistake came for your lane discipline now as you're coming off did you hear that woman yeah. she she oh, she sounded a horn me. yeah she sounded a horn because know, yeah. she was saying listen you're you're occupying both lanes here oh, okay, so yeah. you got a serious mistake for lane discipline there yeah. okay. okay but that yeah. was for you she's trying to squeeze in i'm oh. looking at her she's trying to get into a lane but yeah. you just you're, you're a bit yeah, too yeah. far over to your right and we're we're oh. just hogging up both lanes there Okay, it wasn't extremely over, mm -hmm. but you was enough. You was over enough where Good she couldn't. Be, yeah, yeah, she couldn't proceed in a lane. Yeah. So you're affecting the flow of traffic or mm -hmm. of others, um, and that's unfortunately a serious mistake. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, but not a bad drive at all. Okay, there is loads of positives in there as yeah. well. This is, you know, considering um, we this is our first mock test yeah. and. Um, you know, you didn't know what it's going to feel like. Yeah, yeah. You did pretty good with the serious mistakes. It was just okay, the minors yeah. which yeah. have creeped up, yeah. okay? Um, let's talk about some of these minors, okay? Yeah. So, with the reverse park, first of all, how was that for you? Wait, which one? The parallel park. Oh, yeah. The maneuver. Good. It was okay. You, you, yeah. you were fully in control, I would say, yeah. yeah. So, you, you started the maneuver. Yeah. You got a little bit too close to your left. Um, it's because I couldn't curve. even see the curb that much. So I didn't even know if I was close to it or not. Yeah. Um, now the reason why you got too close is because yeah. you're not staring quick yeah, enough yeah, to your right. I okay, um, but you realise you got you're getting too close, so you went forward uh, to fix the manoeuvre. By now, because you're having to adjust the manoeuvre, mm -hmm. you're going to get a minor for this. This yeah. is just perfectly fine. We'll take that minor yeah. um, rather than mounting yeah. the curb or hitting the yeah, curb. Yeah. So you went forward, and then you, when you start to reverse back, now observations aren't so good either. Now, yeah. okay, we're not observing enough to make sure okay. it's safe. Yeah. Um, so unfortunately, you got a minor for both control and observation in that manoeuvre. Okay. okay. So, so that was that not serious? No, no okay. serious mistake. So, okay. so the only Just serious one. mistake you had was yeah. for the lane discipline on yeah. that roundabout. Okay. okay. Uh, vehicle checks were fine mm -hmm. at the start. The tell me question and the show me question on the drive was perfect. Okay. I was really happy with those. Um, your gears at one point, um, I believe you were in the wrong, in too high of a gear. Was in the roundabout? I don't know. I can't remember. At some point, I felt like we were yeah. in too high of a gear and you had to gear down again, yeah. um, which you managed yeah, to do, yeah. but the car was already struggling yes. quite okay. a bit. Yeah. Okay, I can't remember exactly, but mm -hmm. I feel like the car was struggling. Moving off safely, you got two minors for this. Okay, so two minors for moving off safely. This was basically when you're moving off, you're you're checking all the way around, mm -hmm. but you're checking your blind spot. Show me you checking your blind spot. Okay, this is good now. Okay, but sometimes in <laughs> yeah. your test, what you're doing is just this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's not enough. Yeah. I want to really look over, emphasize yeah. this, make sure you really look into okay. your blind spots because okay. this will limit your view. Yeah, and yeah. if you're just looking like this, it's just there, but you've got all of that section yeah. just there as well. Okay, okay. so just emphasize the, mm -hmm. the the blind spots. So on two occasions, you you were looking in your blind yeah. spot, but, but not, not enough. enough. Yeah. yeah. Okay, moving off of control, uh, at one point just here at the end, um, when the guy flashes lights, you're ready to go, but you're still in second gear. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. make sure we come to a stop. As okay. you're stopping, pop, pop oh, it into yeah. first gear. Okay. Um, I think that's also what I marked it down as. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's a bit fast <laughs> for this road. Um, signals correctly. Um, now, you overtook a bus. Or no, it was it. It wasn't a bus, it was a cyclist. No, it was a cyclist. Correct. You overtook a cyclist. You used your right signal, which is perfect. Yeah. But do we need a left signal to come back in? No. No, I would turn it I off. Now at that okay. point, the cyclist could think that you're putting yeah, over on parking. Park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or that if there was a road there that you're turning into yeah. a road. Oh, yeah. Or if there's a driveway, they're going to yeah. think that you're going into there. Yeah. So just a right signal to overtake mm -hmm. to tell the people behind you overtaking. <coughs> but you don't need that left okay. signal to come okay. back in. Okay. Yeah. Unless you're switching lanes. So if you're going yeah. from one lane to a right lane and then back over yeah. to left lane, okay. then you need a yeah. signal. But at that point, you didn't need that left signal. Okay. okay. Um, signals timed. 
um, we came up to these traffic lights where the sat nav said to turn right, and I feel like you realised as well. You put your right signal on. There was a road just before the traffic lights, yep. and you turned it off. By, yeah. by then, people could. Now yeah, you, you turned it off it. right at the junction, yeah. so people could really yeah, yeah. get confused of what yeah. you're trying to do okay. there. Um, but with that junction there, by the way, you dealt with it really well. The, I don't know if you could tell the traffic lights weren't working there. Oh, I don't even know. Oh, you didn't know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> But that, yeah. those traffic lights, they weren't working, okay? okay yeah. So I feel like you, you didn't panic, and yeah. you didn't think, oh, no, what, what's happening? But the fact that you didn't realise is a bit worrying, okay? But the traffic lights weren't green, nor red, nor amber. Yeah. They weren't on at all, So which means they were, they were gone out, yeah, basically. Yeah. Um, and no one has priority here. you just got to be extra careful, mm -hmm. yeah? Okay, but you just use your general knowledge. Yeah. If you're turning right, yeah. obviously the oncoming traffic is going to have priority. And you've entered into the junction, yeah. you look for a gap and you made the turn. Oh, that's where I gave you your gear fault. Like the car was struggling there. Okay. Yeah, and then you, you finally popped into first yeah, gear yeah, and then made your turn. Yeah, I remember. Okay. Um, but yeah, mm -hmm. well done for dealing with that junction, but make sure you look out for the traffic lights <laughs> next time. Yeah. Um, now this is where you're getting your most amount of minors. Yeah. Now this almost turned into a serious mistake. So I'm going to put a little yeah. star here. This is, okay. you've got to fix this, okay? What is that meeting situation? Your clearance. Okay, so even from the get-go. So when yeah. I told you to drive on from oh, okay. here, there's a parked car on the right yeah. side, okay? Now when you're moving off, you're getting extremely close to mm -hmm. that to that van. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. Now, if you feel like it's quite tight, you could have reversed back. There's no one oh, behind yeah. us here. Yeah. You could have reversed back, got a bigger mm -hmm. gap, and it's yeah. more gradual coming out rather than coming out yeah, really yeah. sharp and getting close yeah. to that to the yeah. parked car on the right. Yeah. Okay? But I feel like at that point, we didn't even need to get that close. You had mm -hmm. plenty more space on your left. You could have started coming back a bit yeah. sooner. So you got one minor there. Another, okay. another uh, same thing again. I asked you to uh, do the parallel park, yep. and then you had to go forward to fix yep. it. And then again, I told you to drive on. You're, you're as yeah. close as this. Yeah. And there's nothing behind you. Yeah, why are you yeah. going to make your hard, your yeah. life this hard? So yeah, why not reverse back and mm -hmm. nice big gap and then drive on? And Is you, it a minor to reverse back? No. When, oh, that's only in parallel and like fixing it. Yeah, that's in like yeah, your bay parking fixing, and yeah. stuff. Yeah. Okay, when, okay, yeah. But if like, for example, whenever I asked you to do your um, parallel park, <clears throat> what we usually say is that you do the uh, you do your maneuver, mm -hmm. and if you've had to go forward, I say you usually reverse back where there's enough space for you to move away yeah, again. Yeah. So that when the examiners check that you you know you've done mm -hmm. your maneuver and you're happy with, it, and when they say okay, thank you, drive on. You've yeah. already done your observations yeah. and reversing back. All you've got to do is drive yeah. on. Okay? okay. At that point, if you're having to reverse back, then you have to do your checks yeah. again, and then yeah. yeah. So do it part okay. of the maneuver. Okay. okay. Remember, you can use up to two car spaces. Yeah. And you can go back and forth as many times as you like. Okay. Okay. Um, so yeah, I felt like we got too close to that car mm -hmm. in front, and then another occasion we're driving down this road, um, and there was a parked car on the left, I think it was a van. Yeah. We're just driving yeah. too close to yeah. it, yeah, yeah. Okay, I almost wanted to push us down all the way, yeah, that. okay. Um, and then another occasion as well, just down here when we're coming mm -hmm. back, there was a oncoming car, mm -hmm. and well, there wasn't an oncoming car, but I yeah. feel like your position is too far to your left. Okay. Yeah. You yeah. need to work on your clearance. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we always want to try keeping a meter clearance. Yeah. If you're having to get closer to the parked cars, yeah. you need to reduce your speed. Yeah. Okay. So anything under a meter, we need to uh -huh. go slower. The smaller the gap, the slower we go. Yeah. If there's no oncoming cars, try getting that meter gap, even yeah. if it means going over the center line sometimes. Okay. Yeah. But as soon as there's an oncoming car, come back to your left. Mm -hmm. Okay. But on four occasions, I feel like we're just too close to parked cars. We're not giving ourselves the clearance. Yeah. Okay. Uh, use of speed. We're coming up to the first roundabout to go straight ahead, second exit. Um, this is where there's no traffic lights and it's a big roundabout. Oh, yeah. yeah, that one that yeah. people usually yeah, don't yeah. like. Um, now, they've introduced a new speed limit there. Just as you see the roundabout sign, there's a 20 sign there. Oh. You're still doing 24 miles per hour there. Oh, yeah. Okay, now a lot of people are forgetting that it's, yeah. it's you know, there's a new speed limit. Yeah. And then people are missing that sign because there's the roundabout mm -hmm. sign and they're paying attention to the roundabout sign, mm -hmm. but they're not paying attention to the speed. But it's actually a 20 zone for a okay. very short period up yeah. until you get up to the roundabout. And yeah, then once yeah. you come off the roundabout into the new road, it becomes into it becomes uh, a 30 okay. road again. So it's important to make sure while you're approaching junctions that yeah. the speed hasn't changed as yeah. well. Okay, but had you been a little bit more faster, 26, 27? That could have been a serious mistake, yeah. okay? Um, I feel like you got lucky in the fact that there was something happening in front, there was traffic mm -hmm. in front, so you ended up going a little bit slower. But you were still over the speed yeah. limit, okay? Yeah. Um, undue hesitation, we came up to a roundabout, and I feel like we're approaching a bit faster in this roundabout. And there was a car on your right, but there's another car in front, which is blocking the path of the right. And I feel yeah. like that person on the right was also turning left, yeah. but we've come to a stop. Yeah. 
we could have kept going okay mm -hmm. so approach a little bit slow where mm -hmm. you're giving yourself plenty of time to observe mm -hmm. and know where that car is going and then ask yourself do i even need to stop there? yeah the answer is no we can carry on yeah okay good um judgment of meeting situation after doing your maneuver the parallel park mm -hmm. when we drove on just further up there yeah. was a bend that yeah. we had to go around and there's a part there was parked cars on both yeah. sides yeah as we've gone into this road, there's an, a, a black car coming towards yeah, us, the woman. Yeah, I know. Yeah? Yeah, the, and she had, to, dog, yeah. she had to go into yeah, that gap. She yeah. wasn't happy, was she? Yeah. No. I don't know if you saw her, but she wasn't happy going into no, that I gap. I was looking at her dog. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> but you should be looking at her because yeah. she wasn't smiling. She was shaking oh. her head. The fact that the reason why is because she's already in between mm -hmm. those cars yeah, now. Yeah? Already, now, you're yeah. the one that can't see down yeah, the road. Yeah. So, yeah? so you've got to come up slow. Make sure you look yeah. down there that there's no oncoming cars yeah. and we can proceed. Now, luckily, there was a gap there. Had there not been a gap there, who's going to have to reverse? Me. Correct, because you're yeah. the one that's just entering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's already traveled yeah. halfway up that road um, and you, that could have been a very easy, serious mistake. But luckily, okay. there was a gap there. She went into it. Mm -hmm. Not happy bunny there, but yeah, yeah we yeah, went yeah. through and then we came back out. Okay, yeah, yeah. so just be careful there. So whenever yeah. you can't see very well and you know there's going to be a meeting, there could be a meeting situation because there's only enough yeah, space yeah. for one car, Take your time, make sure you look up ahead, mm -hmm. um, look through windows as well, through cars yeah. to make yeah. sure there's no movement. If there is, wait there maybe, just let that car pass through and then enter. So reversing in a, a meeting situation, is that uh, serious? Yeah, because it usually means that yeah, you didn't plan you didn't well plan, enough. Yeah. yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, sometimes it wouldn't, it won't be down to you. It could be someone else that didn't plan it. Yeah. Um, but on that occasion, I feel like it if you, me. it was your fault, yeah, yeah because it was we didn't have a good view down that road yep. so you should be proceeding a little bit slower being a bit more cautious trying to look up ahead yep. obviously if you can't see up ahead we're going to have to slowly creep in and you know make, yep. and hope for the best and as soon as you see someone stop and assess how you're going to get yep. around each other but I feel like we just came in a bit too quick mm -hmm. without kind of assessing really nicely um, and she had, she had to go yep. into that gap yep. okay um normal driving position when we're driving down this road just at the end okay we're coming back towards the mm -hmm. test center now there's speed humps but there's only there's a speed hump first of all mm -hmm. first time there's no oncoming cars i was really happy yeah. you went into the middle of the road you went over the speed yeah. hump nicely and yeah. came back to yeah. your left now same thing again another speed hump coming but there's a on uh, sorry a speed hump coming up and there's there an oncoming car yeah. and you're still doing the same thing yeah. <laughs> at this point i felt like there was enough space it's had you been more to your left yeah. correct both yeah, of you yeah. could have passed alongside yeah. each other and he's coming up quite quick and then he's realizing wait she's just traveling in the middle so he's had to stop there to let you go through yeah. um now this can be borderline serious but mm. i feel like you know it was okay mm -hmm. i mean the gap wasn't that big where mm -hmm. it was nice and clear that easily two people could pass yeah, through yeah. there because he was a big vehicle as well yeah. um but i would want to at that to point try, try if there. you can yeah, yeah. Okay? okay so the only time i want you to go into the middle of the road is if there was no one coming yeah, past and no one's overtaking you okay and that's all your serious mistakes uh sorry minor Drums, and serious yeah. and serious mistakes do you understand all of them mm -hmm. it wasn't a bad drive though right yeah, yeah okay I was, I was quite happy with this um you should be glad you've only got one serious mistake. Mm -hmm. The fact that you knew where you had your serious mistake was really good as well. Yeah. Okay. So it shows that you know where it could easily go yeah. wrong and how to fix it for next time yeah. as well. Okay. Okay. Good. Any questions? Mm -mm. No. We're well done for today, and we're going to do another mock test hopefully soon, and then see how that one yeah. how that one goes as well. Okay. Thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, and share if possible. Yeah. yeah, good luck to Hannah.